All right, wanted to send a little message out because I was given a gift the other day and as I read what was in the box, and I'm going to have to actually read it for Peyton, but as I read what was in the box, I realized that so many people needed to hear this message. So um, this is a little gift I was given. I know you might not be able to see it, but it's a little tiny, um, some moon stars and uh, just about finding your way. And here are the words. So forgive me, I have to read this. It says, love the sky you're under. Love the sky you're under. Okay. I hope you learn how to fall in love with your journey. Let go of your past and recognize that your journey is yours for a reason. The challenges that you faced have made you who you are today. They have led you to this very place, a place of growing, of becoming. I hope you learn how to look up at your own sky in its vastness. Um, in its pure in enchantment and realize that there are, are a million and uncharted galaxies waiting to be discovered. I hope you treasure the infinite possibilities while still breathing in the, <laughs> still breathing, while still breathing in the magic of the present. I hope you find the beauty in what's here, what's now. I hope you learn how to appreciate the radiance of your own sky instead of comparing it to someone else's. Isn't that powerful, right? Isn't that powerful? Isn't that powerful? I hope you spend less time chasing their stars and more time valuing your own. I hope you learn to trust in your journey. It is ever-changing, but through the light and the dark, there's always beauty. Have faith in yourself in your own story, and instead of searching for a new sky, learn to love the one you're under. It's where you belong. It's where you are meant to be. So I wanted to share that with you because my journey is quite unique right now. I'm going through a lot of things. And the other day, it just kind of came together. And I realized I just needed to be. Someone said to me, mm -mm, you're not actually resting. You're not actually recouping. You're not actually regenerating. You're still trying to create STEM. You're still trying to do. And I'm like, well, yeah, of course I am. And, and he said, just be, just be. And then I was putting this um, gift on and the person that gave it to me had no idea what my journey is right now when they actually selected this and sent it to me a while back. And I thought, wow, how powerful. So please re-listen to this and hear my words. This is a very impromptu recording. I just literally stuck my laptop on my kitchen counter. And I want you to love the sky you're under. Okay. Love yourself and love the sky you're under.